everybody welcome back to my channel today we went grocery shopping so that means we have a haul as always we went to Aldi's so I'm just gonna jump right in and show you what we got so as you can see here well, as you can see here this is a pretty big shop we needed to stock up we needed to fill the freezer back up, get the kids snacks, all of that. So let's jump in. First we have here the um, multi-grain bread. I use this for Connor's grilled cheese sandwiches. And my favorite favorite is the brioche bread. This time I got rolls because I got ground chicken to make like little sliders. So I wanted to try this. Then we also have the biscuits which Connor likes. The crescent rolls Connor also likes and his cinnamon buns. So Connor likes to go shopping now because he can pick out what he wants. So you're gonna see a couple things that he picked. I don't normally buy, but I told him he could try them and we would see. So moving on, these are my favorite tomatoes to get. I just eat them like grapes really, they're so good. So I got these, I wish they came in a bigger pack, but I got these. I am gonna try this artisan lettuce that my mother told me about. She says it's pretty good. I'm still not eating the romaine. But I need crunch. She said this was a good option, so I'm going to try that. I got my spinach, which I like to have raw as well as cooked. And then these were just there. I figured I'd give them a try for the kids as one of their snacks. So it's our first time getting those. We shall see. I'm just going to move across, no particular order. And then, uh, as always, pickles. If you see any of my other hauls, you know everybody likes pickles, so we get them every time we go shopping. And then I got this pack of the small bottles of Gatorade. Connor was sick, and so he had a lot of Gatorade. And now he wants it all the time, so I'm trying to compromise with that. So I got the little bottles. Um, back here, popsicles. Again, the kids love these. I get them every time we go. And then for breakfast, Connor is pretty much a creature of habit. So we just get the same thing every time. Waffles. Also, you can see French toast sticks. And then we have this turkey. The sausage that he likes, I usually get turkey, but they haven't had turkey lately, so I've just been getting the regular ones. And then we have hot dogs. These are really good, and um, I don't know. He has them once in a while, so I like to keep them in the freezer. Moving on down, we have the butter. Again, I also keep that stocked up in the freezer. I get it unsalted because I season everything, so... I don't know, I just think unsalted is better. And then we have the cheese sticks for the kids and myself. These are the ones, my last haul, I was telling you guys they didn't have them. These are the ones that are the split cheeses that he likes, so I made sure to get those. And then we have just the shredded cheeses. I used to make grilled cheese, tacos, you know, sprinkling whatever recipe I might be doing. Okay, mama, hold on. And then the yogurts, which the kids really like. Hold on, Charlotte's trying to get a grape. Here you go, mama. So we have the, the yogurts that the kids really like. So I like to keep those stocked. Turkey burgers for myself and my husband. This, we do not ever buy. Connor was set on getting it, so I told him he could try it. Um, These chicken patties, I wanted to try. Um, It's like a burger patty, but it's made out of chicken. And it has like veggies and cheese and stuff in it. You wanted to try the mac and cheese, I was telling them. So we have those. Then the dinosaur chicken nuggets for the kids' lunch. Let's see what else we have down back there. Just some elbow noodles. And the penguin. Hold on, please. The penguin, uh, what do you call them? Little cheese things, kind of like the goldfish for the kids' snack. These quinoa chips. All right, for myself, hold on one second, please. I'll let you show them. I gotta say something. Hold on, I'll let you. The quinoa chips, I really like. And then we have the waffle fries. And these little snacks right here, I like to have, because I can put them in my bag when we have to go out and we have snacks for the kids. So that we're not buying stuff every time we're in the store. My little potatoes, which I love. We have some green peppers, onions. Let's see what else. We have these pasta noodles. Um, I pretty much just get them because they're a dollar. They're cheaper than all the other ones. But they do taste good. And I guess them being organic is a plus. So, 
we do have that. And then what else? Jalapenos. My husband like and I like to add spice. So I got fresh ones this time because they had them. I usually get pickled. Shrimp, as I've said in my other vlogs, I mean my other hauls, vlog, whatever you want to call it. I really like shrimp, so I like to have that in there as well. These are already deshelled and deveined, so you just gotta pop them into the pot. Connor coaxed his way into these, so we have those. He also found this, which I thought was really cute. Just a little kit, something fun for him to do. What else? He also found these and he wanted to try it. I guess they're kind of like the Uncrustables, but he likes PB&J for um, lunch. Can I something? So Can we let I him get those. Something? Here, come over here. Say something real quick. So I was going to do a glue party with that because I'm um, glue sweater challenge. So let's get right into the video. He's so silly. He wants to do a video like he did for Christmas, making the ugly sweaters with the cookies. He wants to do that. That's what he's talking about. So we like tacos. We always pick up a taco kit. And then also, my husband wanted to try these. I'm usually a little weary about buying meat that's seasoned, but thought we'd give it a try. This one is Southwest. It's a um a large chicken breast. And then we have the tomato basil flavor as well. So over here, we just have a few ground chicken. We use this the same way as you would use ground beef, ground turkey. Same idea, we just use the ground chicken. And then I have some thin sliced chicken breasts. And then this whole chicken, I don't normally get a whole chicken, but I had a specific recipe in mind, so that's why I grabbed this. And then here we have chicken wings and Connor really likes pasta, so does his dad, so I always get several different sauces just to have in the pantry for different recipes. So, we have different ones. We have a pantry, I just don't use it as a pantry, but we have one. Then we have fruit. The kids um, snack on fruit throughout the day, so I like to have at least... You know two to three different kinds so this week connor wanted the green grapes which we got and then he also wanted to try the pears and i chose the plums because i wanted to give them a try where we no not right now so where we usually keep the other stuff give me a second let me finish telling them and then i will be done back here we have the frozen vegetables um i used to get the fresh vegetables but the frozen ones are fine by me they're fast, easy, and I don't know. I just, they're simple. So the kids like them, we go with them. I got some asparagus, broccoli, which is their favorite, green beans, and then some Asian medley mix. Want to try that out? I also, since we were finally out of rice, got this big sack of jasmine rice. The jasmine rice and the basmati rice are the two I usually get. Back here hiding, we have another. King watch it barbecue. So that is what we picked up today on our grocery adventures. Um, I got mainly everything that I, I wanted to get. There's a couple of little odds and ends um, that I need to go out and get, but for right now, we're good to go. In about a week or so, we'll refresh more veggies. Rather, more um, of the fresh fruit for the kids. So, that's in there for them. But, thanks for watching our haul. Comment down below. Let me know if you shop at Aldi's. What are your favorite things to get there? And, I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.